Monomyth amp. <laughs> said it before, Monomyth has been killing the game. This is a, a modded Marshall, um, pretty much gutted, the way that it was explained to me. Uh, hand, -wound, hand wired board, some bright caps added. Um, there's a lot of different mods. There's a gain mod, there's a bright cap switch mod, um, you know, gives them more of a bright thing. Um, there's like a thump knob or a resonance knob in the back with a three-way voicing toggle. Uh, one is pretty much like a butter slack. It's super, super dark. Um, and honestly, I was messing with it just a minute ago, and it sounded just like sort of in the realm of the Freeman, which is I thought was kind of interesting. Um, and then it has like a, a medium like a medium normal voice and then like a bright voicing. Um, I like the medium. It has that, that black sun mod voicing to it. But um, so yeah, dudes, I'll put the stuff all the way up to total clock in the game. I'll have the, I'm in the high input right now. I'll turn, I'm assuming the fire emblem is the gain switch and then the piece is the bright cap switch. Right now I'm assuming they're both off. Left is on. I could be wrong, but we'll, we'll check it out. Um, no boost, no noise gate. Playing the Music Man Stingray. Here it goes. <laughs> in front of it every amp that I've owned like my 6505 Mesa boogies uh, even some Marshalls I've always boosted my freedom to be e100 I boosted uh, the 50 deluxe I boosted but the butter slacks I never I felt with my boost the Maxon OD 808 um, 40th anniversary from Pictronics for some odd reason to me it doesn't sound good with the Friedman so I never used it and it sounded great I love that this is my favorite Friedman amp I've owned with this, same thing, I love not having it, right? I mean, it's really based on your pick dynamic. Like, if you... Sounds fucking fantastic. Let's uh, put on some high gain. Again, I don't. I'm assuming this is gain. Fire gain. And then bright cap switch. Then it gets 
louder when you flip the, the fire. I don't know. That sounds so flipping good. All right, let's check out the other toggle switches. Um, the knob on the back is pretty much, I would say, at 8 o'clock, kind of where my thumb knob is on the Freebin. This is, again, the voicing is toggles in the middle. Let's go to the left, my left, back of the amp's right. And obviously you can tell it kind of got a little bit darker. We'll see. All right, that's the black mod, black sun mod. Oh, that's totally black. which is my right when you're looking down and then the amps left. I'm assuming this is this is what it is. I could be completely wrong though. Oh yeah, that's totally butter slacks. Fire switch it made it brighter sounding to me. I'm turn that off. See, so does that. Since it's one of the Friedman butter slack side, I'm gonna kind of copy my BE setting or my butter slack settings here. So the thumb knob on the back is pretty much where the thumb knob is on the back on the Friedman. So let's try this here. Um, this is actually set up with P90s. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna be using a humbucker guitar right now. The that's about it. <laughs> Obviously there's gonna be some tonal differences. Um, so, I mean, they're not gonna be the exact same. This is a 50 watt that is 100 watts. You get the drift. But uh, thing is killer, man. This thing rules. This is my second one, like I said. Um, it just rips, dude. This guy knows exactly what he's doing. See, I feel like that's the game. I don't know. What do you guys think? I can't tell. I'll have to ask um, 
Shay on the emblems because I have no idea. But I moved the toggle back to the middle. Let's see how it sounds. So that's that's bright for me. That's way too. I'm gonna have to turn that down. Again, this is the same thing with Friedman amps. This happens. It's not a big deal. this man it gets me going all right let's crank up uh the magic number here again gains at 12. Pretty sure this is the bright switch that's the game switch um let's see how clean this thing gets
not too shabby, man. Jesus, this thing rips. All right, there you guys have it again. Marshall modded Monobeth. Um, pretty much guts out. I mean, this thing rules. It's a, it's a killer of an amp. Said it before, said it again. Dude's insane. Um, I, I don't know what to say. I really don't want to sell my Freeman Butter Slacks. Um, so we'll see what happens. I'm hoping I could uh, recoup fast enough to not have to sell the Freeman. But if I had to sell it, I, I, I'd actually be okay with keeping the, the monomyth alone by itself. But I will say this, if this was able to be able to foot switch through all the settings, like the toggles, like having a button for a gain and the bright switch, actually, to be honest, no. Just the voicing alone, I think I would appreciate it even more. Because this is like, I love my butter slacks just because they're, I could go through three different channels. Uh, obviously, you have your clean and your two overdrives. And this one, I mean, I, I could just obviously, as I demonstrated, you could turn your clean your guitar volume down and have the clean um, on the, the high games. But uh, yeah, I mean, if you're able to do those voicing switch at your feet, that would be killer. That would be awesome. I mean, obviously, even with, I guess, having... I don't even know if you could be able to switch it from low input to high input too. That would be cool because then you could have it as like a foot switched voicing amp clean. Obviously you have one set of knobs, but I don't know. I digress. It's killer amp. Shay, you killed it. Well done.